Libra. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. It's your world. I am Niambi Shalee. Welcome to my Libra channel. I'm a spiritual teacher. I read energetically, intuitively, and spiritually. I also study planetary alignment to help those that are led to my channel understand the energies that we're in. If you're 18 years or younger, go ahead and back out because I do use profanity. If you are offended easily, do that too. All right. All right. This is the extended. These are the cards that came out to my love. And y'all already know when I see this. I want to thank every last subscriber. I want to thank everyone who comments. I want to thank everyone who donated, and I will get all into detail a little bit later. But I hope you enjoyed this setup. This is not something that we're going to go to all the time. But from time to time, I would like to switch it up and... Um, you can actually see the cards better and get um, a clearer picture of the story. Um, this is where your donations go to. This is what this is what I do with your donations. Um, this is your channel, and it goes back to the channel. So you see, it. you see, it. I said happy birthday. The world card is a representation of. Coming back down the birth canal as an adult. When you get the judgment right after that, this is just a small recap. I'm not going to go into detail on that. Um, when you see the judgment after the world card, this is like not understanding that you just had a major chance. You just got a major chance. And so you have to get called again. And getting called again simply means you have to go back through this process. It's like being stuck, too stuck in an old mindset where you get a new path, but you go the, you go basically do that new path with the same tactics, with the same things that you did last time. Um, you got the four of cups and four of cups just meaning you don't see your options. You don't, you're not looking at, you're not looking at either cup. And that's in the heart space. Um, this is a soaking pity party. Woe is me. Um, everything is going badly. I don't know um, what to do next, but not even attempting to see the cups and acting. This is like, this is like blank stare. Like divine gives you the cup and you like blank stare, blink, blink. Um, and then, here come Hermit ass. Here come Hermit. Y'all know what that is. I left the light on. Get your ass up there. This is the mountain top. It is thinking higher. It is introspection. It is what can I do to see. Then we have Earth energy hitting the table for the first time. This is, you can think that lowly way that you think as if um, this is going to work every week, waiting on Friday. Not realize it in the, in the like, oh, I can't wait till Friday to get here. This is like Walking around not understanding that there's a spiritual realm. Walking around just, there's no, you don't see a higher direction. And because wherever you're, wherever you're, and you know, uh, pinnacles being what you can have on earth, it's like wherever you think that you want to be, because you can always take that higher pinnacle. You can always delve into, and this is new times. So it's like, I would suggest taking the higher one, taking the higher. I told you, every time you see um, red on the pinnacles, it's power, it's power in your thoughts. So think higher and, um, 
and then you get the Ace of Swords. That's that's Libra energy. That's air energy. That's I weigh this motherfucker any kind of way I want to. To cut anything out. To do anything I gotta do in order to get out of this heart space. Then, as I said, this is the extended. These are the cards that came out. The hangman, the pinnacle, and then you see it. You see it. And usually I ask the question, who fucking with my baby? But in this, in this, it's all you. This all you. Because even in the judgment card, it's people waking up. It's not just you waking up. It's not just you getting a, an awakening, getting a call. Tons of people go through a spiritual awakening at the same time. The same way demons is waking up. Yeah. Star seeds waking up. Sun babies is waking up. And it's fire energy. So it's like when you wake up, you got to. And what is fire? Fast. It moves fast. It, it burns off the old and, and and ready for the new. Ready for the new. You know, um, as, I mean, just as simple as, it's gone, like, I just got this a couple days ago. It's gone. So what do I do? I buy a new one. And it's the same thing. It's like you can't, um, you, you, you will not be allowed to stay once you, and I, and I, and I think of it like this, once you are no longer any earthly good, it's like the energy is so fast right now. People are like, it's different ways that they are not being able to show up in the world, you know? So it's like, if you're not using your mind, all right, let's get, let's, let's, uh, you know, I don't want that energy in the read, so I'm not going to say it. But it's like, um, it's, come on, basically. Come on. This this is you. This is you sticking you. Um, Okay. Let me see what Baby Boss Deck has to say because you get the world and then you get the hermit and you get the hangman. You get judgment. You get the, the two of pentacles and then it's saying no, no. It's one of pentacles. Get one practice. That hat. That hat. It's like, oh, I'm getting it. Okay, I got the call. All right. I know that um um it's it's like getting a call for from a about that money. You know, it's like getting a call. If you got a call for and see this is spiritual, right? So if you got a call for a job to make a million dollars, you gone. So you got the call in the spirit realm. So how about take off? Okay, even if it's small, you're getting it. And and this is like getting that one spiritual practice where you take five minutes a day and you say, all right, let me get to source. It's like the, the small practice of, um, all right, well, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say my stuff out loud. I ain't need, I, I don't have to lay down. I don't gotta bend my knees. I don't gotta do none of that. I could just say it. And, and the shit pop up. And then when you do that, when you release that thought process, that old mind, the old way of thinking, it's like the divine will come in and show you little things. You know, Libra is a social butterfly. Libra is busy as hell. So it take a lot. And that's why when I see this car, it's like it takes a lot to get Libra's attention. You know, even you, you, you know it for yourself, even with partners. Once, once it hit the fan, it's like they had to do a lot to get your attention because that little shit don't matter. So don't uh, don't wait for the divine to do a lot to get your attention. Take heed the call now, and and the call is just, you know, realize you a spirit, like realize that I'm I'm here. Like hello, hey hey, you know. Come on, Baby Boss Deck. For my newbies, this is Baby Boss Deck. And um, it doesn't allow me to speak while shuffling 
while shaking. And sometimes it won't give me anything if I don't shuffle it. So, all right, baby boss deck. You see the story. Give me some, give me clear messages for Libra. What does Libra need to know? Clear. Clear. Okay, when Empress come out, um, for my, for my newbies, I just want you to understand that, um, Libra is Empress. Libra is born on the throne. Libra has to protect itself because if you do not, the divine will come in. You were born on a throne. The Venus symbol is on the heart. The heart has, is a shield. So if you at any moment get heartbroken, it's, it's got to, there's something that got to be done. So either you pull yourself out or, you know, and so I, I love this. I love the story. I love the story. And I'll get to that in a minute. Come on, baby boss deck. Yeah. Now you know motherfucking Baby Boss Deck. Oh wow. And I'm gonna get this card that popped out. And I'm gonna put that right there. And guess what's under the deck? Okay, now this story is the Page of Pentacles again. This is confirmation of this. Y'all gonna make me snap, like for real. Because the Page of Pentacles comes out on it's your birthday, it's your birthday. Pull back from people, things, places, ideas that you once had. Pull back. Because once you get the right idea, you can get your shit in the earth realm. It's something fucked up. This is conflict. This is conflict. So. This is conflict. In the earth realm. But. With this coming before this. Is. You're, you're starting to understand. Remember I said. That whole bottom, the, the first six was about trying to take the same, do it the same way, even though you have a new path. It's like, oh, when I, when I walk down this path, I did this, this, and this. And as you go down this new path, you're going to do the same thing and, and wait to get a different result in this situation because things are going so fast that's not you're not going to get a different result it's going to loop you back around the universe is going to continuously loop you back around until you get the lesson and it and then it's like this this is like not tower moment it's like i'm gonna keep on doing you the universe is gonna keep on Come on. You want to do it again? Come on. Yeah, let's do it again. Yeah. Like, that's just, that's just what I see. 
I don't see any danger. I don't see any towel moments. I see, yeah, it's like the universe ready to do it again too. Okay, next, we're going we're gonna to go the same way. We're going to take a different path and do the same thing. All right, let's learn that lesson again. Yay! Hell no. Because the empress get the star and the sun. Healing. Healing. Yeah. Like, what, what do you need? And whatever you want, babe. Whatever you want to do, babe. However you want to. This whole story. Go within. Introspect. I get it. Don't nobody want to look at themselves. You don't want to see what you do. Because you, you, you were born again. You get to do whatever the fuck you want to do. This is like. You been looking at, it's, it's, this is comparing yourself to other people. This is look at what they got. See, they way ahead of the game than me. They, they really doing that shit. No, uh, no, you got a power behind you. Because you, Empress must be protected at all times. So if I got a power behind me, why the fuck would I be worried about what somebody else got? That's telling God's spirit source that you can't have when you got God's spirit source. I can have whatever the fuck I want to have. Now, sit up there, get up there on that and die out of the old mindset. Allow the divine to communicate with you so you can change things in the earth realm. 